love with Niagara on the lake so quickly. The downtown was just so picturesque and gorgeous and wandering around and stopping in little shops. I really felt like I was a character straight out of a book. The downtown area was just so beautiful. There were so many flowers and unique places to stop. It really was a wonderful experience just exploring this little beautiful place. Falls to go hiking. Going on this hike, I once again felt like I was in a book, only this time instead of feeling like I was in like Bridgerton or an Austin novel, I felt like I was in The Lord of the Rings. This was such a picturesque hike and despite it being so hot outside, it was such an amazing experience. Um, Balls Falls, the falls were not really falling but it was still really cool and the water just looked so nice and inviting, especially since we were all sweating and so 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 hot it was so green and lush and we actually wandered around at the bottom of the river that leads to the falls or that the falls like flows into and this is a cool rock that i found very lord of the rings hobbit-esque landscape
For those of you who don't know what the Bruce Trail is, allow me to explain. It is basically a hiking trail that connects from Tobermory, Ontario to Niagara Falls, Ontario. And it cuts through a lot of conservation areas along the way, including some that my family and I like to frequent when we're going hiking. Before the plague, we took a trip up to Tobermory and visited the northern point of the trail and hiked down there and we decided that one day we would want to go and visit the southern point and that's what made this a destination for us. The trail goes along the Niagara Escarpment which was formed during like the Ice Age by glaciers and it is such a cool landscape. It's so incredible and if you have the chance to visit either of these locations I would definitely recommend it. The scenery is so gorgeous and you're just so immersed in nature. It's just so incredibly wonderful.